Hi Taurus, welcome back to my channel. This is the Sacred Sun Tarot and you're watching your mid-month update. This is uh, for Taurus Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus and Jupiter signs. And uh, Three of Cups wanted to pop out. Maybe possible reconciliation or a party mode. This is uh, for uh, the mid-month November, a general read. This may resonate in any aspect of your, your life. This can be career, finances work life family or love however it resonates with you you can take it do hit the subscribe button to stay updated with the videos and uh, do write down in the comment section below how this reading resonates with you so let's get started what's up for taurians what what is up for taurians so there are some cards here want to pop out let's see this is a general spread the overall situation in upcoming days, conflict. So the bull gang is in a mood to fight, in a mood to have conflict. This may be some competition. Maybe you're facing very tough competition around you. Maybe uh, this can be a family situation. This can be work life situation where you are facing a lot of competition, very, very tough competition. And the growth in this uh, scenario is very difficult. This can be a job-like situation where you have a lot of competition. What's your mind space here? You're getting very emotional. Maybe you are uh, trying to listen to your intuition and you're very emotional right now. You're wondering, am I on the right track? What I'm doing, is it correct? Uh, is, it, is it the right uh, career path? Is it the right path I have chosen? Or is it a right person I am with? I see a lot of questions here. And moreover, I feel they're not just questions. They are literally, I feel that because of this competition, you've literally doubted, you've started doubting yourself. Not good. What can be the past? So what was the past situation which has brought you to this conflict? What was the past situation here? So, okay. So maybe you wanted financial independence or maybe you wanted your finances to grow. I see you wanted your independence, you wanted your freedom, and maybe you were not able to decide some things, you were defensive, and you were waiting for your finances to grow. And uh, I feel here that uh, it's like somebody is willing to raise their, how should I say that, their uh, reputation, their uh, popularity, their finances, somebody wants to grow up, somebody wants to take a big step. They want to have a better lifestyle, they want to have a better, better finances. And I think this major conflict is arising because of their state of mind. This can be you or the person you're dealing with, the energies can be vice versa of course. But I guess you're very, you're very emotional right now because uh, I feel that this can be a situation where you have to compromise with your independence. You have to compromise with your uh, finances or you have to compromise with something very important to achieve something. And this is causing a major conflict around you. Please give me the grounding energy here for Taurians. What can be the grounding energy here? So, okay, a que queen of swords. This can be an air sign individual, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, who is going to impact your decisions very bad. This can be an air sign. This can be your boss in your office or maybe your mother or somebody who is very controlling, somebody who is having, who is on a position of authority. It's a court card. Somebody on a position of authority, somebody who is very harsh, very stubborn. And this lady, possibly a lady, can be man also. But she is going to impact your decisions very harshly, in a very hard manner. And moreover, I feel that this is, this is the point where your independence is coming to a question. Your, your financial independence, your uh, finances, your opportunities are coming to question. And this is causing a major conflict. What can we expect as an outcome here? What can we expect as an outcome here? Seven of Swords. So... Some lies, some deceit, some... So somebody wants to move on, somebody wants to move forward. But I guess 
there can be some cheating involved here please clarify this five of wands what does this five of wands mean here why why is there so much competition okay so i feel that uh, this competition is mainly because of opportunities around you there's comparatively less opportunity and more people rushing towards see can you see this Maybe an earth sign entering the picture here and the air sign entering the picture from here. And they both are colliding. They both, there's a conflict because of this, this the whole situation is creating, getting, becoming a mess. I feel that this can be a situation where uh, for one thing, maybe there's a small opportunity and multiple people are fighting for that single opportunity. And uh, I see influence of almost all the signs here. There's there's earth sign, there's uh, air sign, like, you know, there's water sign. I think this is you. This is you getting emotional. You, you're wondering whether am I capable enough, whether I am good enough for this particular opportunity, whether I'm good enough for this particular person here. Because I see at least two people fighting for one opportunity. And this is going to result in a major conflict. This is going to result in a major uh, competition a lot of comp i see a very competitive environment here please clarify this queen of cups why is your mind of state of mind as queen of cups ace of wands you want new beginning you want new start maybe you're trying to keep stay strong maybe you're trying to uh, transform yourself and you're trying to take some major decisions in your life but overall your mindset is that you are you've started questioning everything around you and now it's the point where you want some new passion in your life you want to cut out everything which is not serving you in this environment and overall you feel that i want new passion i want new options i want new opportunities because the opportunity right now is very small and there are uh, different people who are actually fighting for that opportunity multiple people who are fighting for that small opportunity so bad that probably you're not getting your say in the situation that's why you're looking for something new why is this nine of pentacles here why is this nine of pentacles here four of pentacles and ten of swords so maybe you started something new maybe you walked out of the situation and you wanted to start something new but uh, overall i feel that uh, in the beginning maybe you were feeling financially good but suddenly something ended maybe you got uh, rejected because of something maybe somebody turned down your offer and because of that uh, a sort of financial crunch came in the situation there was sort of financial crunch here and this financial i see a major ending so maybe something ended maybe a project ended maybe uh, a career situation ended or maybe you ended something because you were not able to take the burden of that situation and you started holding back. You started holding back. This can also re represent a financial crunch here. Maybe you were facing a little bit of financial crunch in this situation because of a major ending that took place. And your uh, financial independence was actually challenged because of that ending. But I definitely feel that you're looking for new passions. You're exploring options here. Please clarify this Queen of Swords. Why is this Queen of Swords influencing your actions justice two phones my god some major decisions are there some major major decisions are going to be taken there's somebody in the equation who's very controlling and very justice loving this can be i, I see a strong libra influence this can be libra rising of course and somebody is making some tough decisions maybe they're choosing someone over you or maybe they are deciding to cut you off from the situation they're, they're very decisive somebody very controlling somebody very decisive and this person is going to influence your situation very bad maybe because of this person this is the person why your um, financial security got challenged your financial independence got challenged please clarify this uh, um, seven of swords here five of pentacles queen of cups again and eight of pentacles and the judgment so this can this is giving me a vibe here that uh, i do feel that you have a very emotional state of mind and you really want to work on yourself focus on your pentacles 
and I feel that you're literally avoiding the stuff around you. You're literally avoiding people around you. You you're avoiding the competition, the the dirty competition situation they are creating. You're just just avoiding them for time being, and overall. You feel cold because there's somebody in the equation who is not honest. This can be you also, Taurians. This can be you also, definitely you. So uh, maybe you want to sneak out of a situation where you feel that if you enter this situation, you are going to be dependent on multiple people. And you don't want your independence to be challenged. You don't want your independence to be questioned and that's why maybe you're hiding some facts from this person this can be a situation where you don't want to tell about your finances to your uh, some of your family members because maybe they are going to question them and if you actually be honest with them this is going to result in financial de financial dependence over them so maybe you just want to sneak out of this condition and uh, you don't want to honestly tell everything about your career, your finances or whatever you're going through right now to this particular person because uh, you feel that if you actually commit to this person, you actually tell this person everything, this is going to result in some sort of dependence over that person. Maybe that person will be actually able to control you if you tell all the details to them. So I feel that you're not going to tell all the details to this person. You're definitely going to hide something from this person. And uh, I still feel the emotions are going to continue you, you, in a very emotional state of mind. You're very, uh, you're very much... Uh, you're very much closed off. I feel that you're closed off and you're just willing to work on the situation on your own. You don't want anybody's assistance. You don't want anybody to interfere in your work for time being. And you just want to go away from this competition. And you just want to avoid this competition and rather start something else. So I see very conflicting energy. I feel that you wish to start something else, but there's a lot of competition. So you want to avoid that competition and prevent your dependence over anybody. There may be a, a Libra or, or an air sign who's going to influence your decisions a lot. So beware, from, beware of this person. Maybe some decisions this person is going to take, which is going to influence your financial status. This can definitely influence your financial status or your reputation in your work life so thank you so much for watching this reading do hit the subscribe button to stay updated with the videos and do write down in the comment section below how this reading resonates with you